Hi, I'm going to show you how to manage your project folder and how easy it is to share your iSpring projects with your team. First things first, what is a project? A project in iSpring is a combination of your original PowerPoint presentation file and the respective project folder that stores your project files. This means that your iSpring course includes not only your PowerPoint presentation with the slides, but also in a separate folder, all of the resources that you added to the course like audio, quizzes, videos, and more. iSpring creates this folder automatically when you go to the iSpring Suite tab in PowerPoint and add something to your project. This folder is labeled under the same name as your PPTX file. The best place to store your iSpring project is on your local drive because it'll be faster and provide easier work with resources. Storing your projects in other places like OneDrive or a network drive will never provide you with the same experience due to latency. We recommend that you put every PowerPoint presentation that will become an iSpring project into a separate folder. This will make your experience with iSpring much simpler and therefore easier. Otherwise, you might risk losing your project folders. If at any point you want to export a project in order to collaborate with team members, create a backup or send to support. It's easy to do so. I want to share this project with my colleague Alex so he can make sure all of the information is correct. I'll start by heading to the File tab and then selecting Share. When the Export window pops up, I will select Share iSpring Suite Project here and then choose Export Project. Now I can decide where I want to save the folder by specifying a folder name and a new location of the backup folder. I will also want to select this Create Zipped Package box to ensure that I get a zip file. This will come in handy if I need to send my project via email. Next, I will select Export to copy this PowerPoint presentation to a new location. The zipped package will contain a copy of the PowerPoint presentation as well as the iSpring project folder. And that's it! Now all I have to do is send an email to Alex and I'm ready to go. I told you it was easy.